A new security finding has come in through a Splunk Enterprise Security Detection. Now this log source indicates that PowerShell.exe launched a Base64 encoded command. Now I would like to assist my analyst team with a new playbook that they can use to get the installed applications for the device observed in this finding. I'll use Splunk Soar's native playbook integration with Enterprise Security to build the playbook, test the playbook, make it available to my analysts. The first thing I'll need is the name of the device ID field so I can leverage it in my playbook I'm about to build to look up the software. I'll start developing a playbook by opening the content navigation menu and going to the SOAR playbook listing page. From here, I can create a new playbook and for the type, I'll pick Enterprise Security. From the side panel, I wanna grab an action block. I'll select this organization's endpoint provider and scroll down to the action, get installed software. This action wants a device ID field and I'll input the tokenized data path from that field I discovered in the security finding. Since this is not a default field, I'll go ahead and add it to the possible options. Next, I want the analyst to consume this information as a markdown formatted table. I'll select from the Enterprise Security API block and pick Add Finding or Investigation Note as my action. For the ID field, SOAR has pre-selected the available fields that are compatible. For the title, I'll make it dynamic and indicate that this is a software inventory for the destination field from the finding. The content field should also be dynamic, and I'll start with a simple explanation of the table. And I'll give the table a heading. Also indicate how many columns are in the table. And finally, I'll let SOAR populate the table with the output of the preceding block. First, our application ID. The application name. And finally, the application vendor. And that's it. My playbook is now complete. I'll connect up to the end block and give it a save. Let's test how this looks. I'll open up the debugger and paste the finding ID and hit test. Looks like it ran successfully and returning to Splunk Enterprise Security, I see I have a formatted table with all of the application details of the target endpoint. Hmm, I don't recognize this vendor and I'm wondering if there is more to this finding. As an analyst, I can start an investigation where I can also follow a response plan, run additional searches, actions, and playbooks from SOAR, and collaborate with my security operations center. With Splunk SOAR and Splunk Enterprise Security, it has never been easier to give your security team the power to move at machine speed.